I'm Stacey Solomon and I'm here for the new SpongeBob 3D movie. I am the voice of a seagull. Woo! It was pretty tough to get into the mind of a seagull. <laughs> I had no idea like exactly what the character was like, what to do, how to be, um, but uh, the director was really lovely and I felt so comfortable and had so much fun in there. I loved being a seagull. I could hear all the other voiceovers um, that had come in before me, so all the other seagulls were squawking away, which really helped. It gave me a little idea of what I was supposed to be doing. When Paramount called me and asked me to be a part of SpongeBob, my initial reaction was, I'm gonna look so cool. <laughs> I have a, a two-year-old and a six-year-old who obviously love SpongeBob. So to be asked to be a part of something that is a really big deal in my house, I was really excited. I know a fair amount about SpongeBob. I've been watching it a good, a good six years now. <laughs> My kids love it. And actually, I find it really funny. I think there's a lot of adult humour in there, which satisfies both me and the kids. I don't... Do you know what? I have no idea why SpongeBob is so, so popular. It's hilarious for me. I find it funny. I find it light-hearted and the colours are amazing, but my kids are obsessed. I don't, I'm like, what is it? And they just love it. A sponge wearing pants. <laughs> and uh, what is it? What do you think? Um... What's not to love? I think the kids, for me, love SpongeBob. Like, uh, they're drawn to the main character and he's bright yellow, which is a big deal for a two-year-old. And, 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 and he's funny and he has a funny voice. So I think Spongebob is their favourite. I'm going to be so excited to watch the film with my two children. They're going to be so proud of me. <laughs> and I, I hope they notice that I'm one of the seagulls. But when they do, uh, I think they'll be, I think they'll be like, wow, wow, mum, after everything I've done, this will be like the highlight for them. <laughs> When it came to me singing the theme tune, I did know it very well, but I had to, <laughs> I had to really like think about it because it comes so quickly and the words are, are a little tongue twistery. <laughs> so I did have to think about it quite a bit, but no, uh, the tune and everything else I knew quite well. <laughs> I felt safe. Voiceover is completely different to singing. Like. Um, when I'm in the studio and, on a, and I'm singing a song, I can just sort of relax, chill out, and go into wh whatever zone I feel like at the time. Whereas voiceover, you have to be something or someone else, and you have to give that certain expression, you have to become a character, which I think is completely different. Just as enjoyable, but really, really different. Um... Singing live in front of people is really nerve-wracking, but it's something that I absolutely love and have become really comfortable with and, and done quite a lot, luckily. Um, voiceover I've not done very much of, so it's really scary. And knowing that like millions of people are going to watch it actually scares the life out of me. <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing a film and Antonio Banderas is in it. I feel like the coolest person ever right now. <laughs> Winning. Antonio Renderes' character is pretty funny. He's a little angry pirate, Burgerbeard. <laughs> Constantly telling me off, the seagull, trying to sort of explain the story, but every time the seagulls get overexcited, he sort of puts them in their place. I really enjoy that the film mixes live action and cartoon, because I just feel like, for me, it just completely is different to any other cartoon or any other sort of kids live action film. It's lovely to go in and out, see the real life version and the cartoon version. I love it. And it's nice to see the characters as they would be like in real life. I thought that was really cool. Uh, the 3D element is always exciting, especially for the kids. Like, my children love just putting on the glasses. <laughs> and then it comes out at you. I'm really excited to, to watch it and see all, all different kinds of action going on. It's got it all. Don't be a plankton. Go and see SpongeBob SquarePants the Movie 3D in cinemas everywhere. Woo!
Go see SpongeBob SquarePants the movie 3D in cinemas everywhere March 27th.